GoForge has approved raising 3200 crore rupees through a QIP, so keep that on your radar. In confirmation of a CNBC TV18 news break, the government has approved a 17% wage hike for LIC that will benefit employees and also those who receive pensions. Zydus Life has received a final approval from the US FDA along with a 180 day exclusivity to market a drug used in treating prostatic hyperplasia. Hindustan Aeronautics has won an order worth 2890 crores from the Indian Navy. Railtel has won a 352 crore order from the BMC and another one in Bihar as well. Amber Enterprises has formed a new unit to deal in railway components and railway stocks. Kotak Institutional Equities has upgraded auto ancillary stocks like Uno Minda, CIE Automotive and Varok Engineering citing attractive valuations. Jefferies has highlighted 11 stocks that can deliver 15 to 25% CAGR over the next 5 years. These include names like Ambuja Cement, Axis Bank, LNT and others. And lastly, Biocon and Hindustan Copper are back in the FNO band for today's session.